guys, this hands down might be one of the best crypto wallets I've ever seen. Like this wallet is a whole next level and I'm so excited to show you all the features, show you how to install it. This video is gonna be a tutorial video to install your Kadena wallet, which is the Zelcor wallet. This video was presented by Peak DeFi, the DeFi ecosystem to grow your wealth. So if you come to the Kadena docs, you'll see that they have Zelcor, which is a user-friendly wallet for storing and trading Kadena. So you can click on it through the docs or you can click on it through the link in the description below. I've got a link to Zelcor. You can check it out there. Okay, so some main features of this wallet. Obviously, you can buy and store crypto. They have a self-managed, no custodian required. Login details never leave your device. You can import thousands of Ethereum, Tron, or BNB tokens, and one account, all devices. Awesome. So we're gonna come down to the end of the webpage, and you can see that you can download for Windows, Mac, or Linux. I'm gonna download for Windows because I have a Windows, and I'm gonna choose to download it onto my desktop. So once we've downloaded Zellcore to the desktop, a pop-up is gonna appear like this, where we can log in, or we can sync or register an account, and you can see, Next to this, they have an at a glance, which is all the recent news articles in cryptocurrency. Like this article came out at 1 p.m. today. Like this is a recent news article. And you can see already, like we haven't even registered an account or logged in. And you can already see that it, this wallet has a lot of functionality. All right, so now we're gonna go sync or register account to this device. And we're gonna pick a username. I'm gonna go peak D5. And then we're gonna create a password. Make sure that your password is strong to moderate. Uh, and by that, I mean capital letters, numbers, exclamation marks, all that kind of stuff is really good. And then we're gonna toggle create recovery password mechanism. And then we're gonna click sync register account to this device. So it's here that you can set your recovery password mechanism. So you need to have selected at least three questions to create your recovery setup and continue with your account creation. But you can use as many questions as you wish. Remember that if someone knows you well enough, they might know the answers to these easier questions. So keep that in mind. The more questions you choose, the more protected you will be. The answers are not case sensitive. So we're gonna pick three questions. We're gonna go, okay, what's your favorite food? Tacos. Um, what, when did you meet your spouse? I don't have a spouse. Um, what is the make model of your first car? Kia Rio. And the third question, uh, who was your childhood hero? Um, I don't even know. <laughs> Maybe that's a bad question. Let's, let's, let's pick a different question because I have no idea. Um, what's your favorite color? Orange. Look at that, you guys know all these fun facts about me now. So after we've picked those three questions, we're gonna go register account. Okay guys, so this pop-up has appeared and it's super important that you understand this. So it says that your account credentials are the key to access your funds. Make it as strong and unique as possible. There is no way to retrieve or change your username or password. If you lose either your username or password, you will lose access to your account permanently back up. Both username and password are case sensitive. It is very important that you keep a copy of your credentials somewhere safe. So you're gonna to toggle, yes, I have backed up both my username and password, and you're gonna click sync register account on this device. All right, so here we are. I've logged into my wallet and I'm in the wallet summary and you can see like this wallet has such a sleek, clean design. Like whoever did the UI and the UX for the Zellcore wallet did an excellent job. So you can actually categorize your assets into payments, income, mining, investments, retirement, scholarship. And like comparing this to wallets like MetaMask, you can see how much more functionality it has, how clean it is. Uh, and you know, there's so much more on offer with this wallet than there is with other wallets. For example, if you go to your assets, and you're gonna go show zero balance because if you've just set up your wallet, I doubt you've sent any of your crypto to the wallet yet. So go show zero balance. We're gonna click on Bitcoin and I'm gonna have to make myself smaller so you guys can see all the information that's available here. So not only do we have 
a chart for Bitcoin, but we have the market cap, we have the 24 hour volume, we have the max supply, we have the circulating supply, we have Facebook, Reddit, website, we have a blurb about what Bitcoin is. We have all the latest news. So this functionality is amazing because if you're trading within the wallet, you don't need to like exit and then go look at coin market cap or, you know, go to Google news and, and look at the latest news for Bitcoin because it's all here within the Zellcore wallet. All right. So I want to show you some really cool features to this wallet. So if you go to exchange, you can actually connect your wallet to decentralized exchanges like through the app. So I can connect to QuickSwap, Serum Dex, Binance Dex. But on top of that, I can actually connect to centralized exchanges through an APY. And before I made this video, I connected my KuCoin account to the Zellcore wallet. So I'll show you what that looks like. All right, so you can see here my KuCoin wallet. So I can see the balances uh, in USD and I can see I have some Kadena, I have some Renda, and I also have some Kadena and Renda in open orders. So I can check out my open orders here. I can look at my deposit withdrawal history. I can go to settings and change the layout. Like this is just next level functionality. And I think the word of this video is gonna be functionality. <laughs> Cause I've said it so many times. Like this wallet has a lot of functionality. So another cool feature to this wallet is that you can actually buy cryptocurrency with a Visa or MasterCard. Like you can use fiat to buy cryptocurrency. So if you go to the purchases in the navigation, and obviously I'm in Australia and I wanna buy with AUD. So I'm gonna, you know, spend $100 on Bitcoin. So I'm gonna go agree with the disclaimer, go next, input all of my details, my address, all that kind of stuff. Obviously this isn't real information. Go next. And you can see the total payment is gonna cost me $107. I'm gonna put in my Visa or MasterCard and I can purchase Bitcoin and it'll go through to my Zellcore wallet. So the Zellcore wallet also has apps that you can integrate within the wallet. So if you go to apps in the navigation, uh, you can see an array of applications that can be incorporated. Now I wanted to go through the Zell ID because this is the one that I find the most fascinating because apparently it's more secure than your traditional two-factor authentication, which is like your, your Google authentication, which you might have on your phone. Uh, but you need to uh, transfer some Flux in order to get this going. So I did just before transfer some Flux from my KuCoin into my Zellcore. Alrighty, so I'm gonna go create my D2FA. So I'm gonna enter a pin um, and it says, used for logging into your Zellcore, used to secure tasks such as transac transacting, viewing private keys and Zell ID operations. Uh, yes, I have backed up my D2FA pin number. I'm gonna enter my password, set up, and success, that's all set up. So that kind of adds a layer of security for my wallet. Alrighty, so I just logged out of my account and I'm gonna log in using my Zelle ID, which I just set up and see how it goes. By the way, guys, if you've enjoyed this video, if you love Kadena, give me a like, leave me a comment. Let me know what you think about this wallet in comparison to a lot of the other wallets that are out there. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel because I make videos every week on how you can make money in cryptocurrency or learn about cryptocurrency. So yeah, and also we have some amazing content creators on this channel. Also, you can watch my in-depth video where I tell you about why I'm so bullish about Kadena right here. All right, guys, I'll see you next time.